What's up, nerds? It's Matt and Craig. I won the die roll. I think it's the first one I've won in like three weeks. They're Dragon Shield Ember Dual Mats. Because someone's about to ask. Uh, these are sleeves. Yep. Play a Temple Garden. I'll pass. Wow, no, what? I will also play a tap Temple Garden. You're playing green the white map? What's going on here? What the fuck does it do then? Are you playing my game? Play Sparrow's Headquarters. Oh, pass. Now I genuinely have no clue what's going on. Draw. You're just playing a morph creature. Virtually, yeah. Cavern of Souls. No human. Coat Vanguard. Go ahead. Look at the top two and then the extra. So you can change the order of how you give it scry to. Beans. Mm-hmm. Chalker. Everybody's on beans to talk to. Okay. I think you know, for that. Reading pool. Pass. I was like, Brett, I'm playing your favorite card. He was like, Baneslayer? I was like, your second favorite card. He was like, Thoughtseize? I was like, your third favorite card. What did you say the third time? Nickel Bolas. <laughs> I didn't even specify which Nickel No, just one of them. Day three. Reckless Storm Seeker. Yep. Uh, yeah, give it to him. Swing for six. One, two, three, four, five. Checks and Yeah, yeah, that's six. And go ahead. Whenever an, a permanent enters the battlefield, cause a trigger, counter it unless they pay two. Yeah. Actually, yeah. For all players. I need to hit a land drop. Um, I guess we have to hit the Vanguard because it doesn't have ward. That's true. So trigger Beanstalk. Land. Exiled forever or until Exiled it? until that leaves. Oh, okay. Land, I got it. Uh, pass. Still not great for me. Because he's still got Hasty Boy. Or give Land Hasty return. Boy, I guess. Coco? Mm -hmm. The old main phase. Flying trample. The beginning of your end step target opponent may sacrifice two non token permanents. If they don't, they can each apply Interesting. Cool. It's not the greatest I've ever done. Um, okay. They'll enter together, so he evolves. Mm -hmm. Draw your card. <laughs> Oh, it's not the worst hit. No, I mean it is a hit. So <laughs> go to combat, mm -hmm. give it to him. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. for seven. Um. Go two, three, four, five, seven. Yep. yep. Go to seven. Draw a card. And go ahead. I think that's the only line that keeps me alive. Uh, so we'll try it. Incarnation. Yeah. Can I go to this end step here? Yep. I don't know if it's enough. Shoot a route. You got some gates in there? No. All right. I don't actually know which is better here. I can grab Titan of Industry or I can grab a Trax. Uh, Trax gives me the lifelink and cards, whereas Titan can gain me five. If you attack with that, I'm not blocking. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's a trap. I've done so. that math. Because <laughs> I need to hit lands right now, too. Uh, Fair enough. Go ahead. 
Yeah, draw two cards. I need some removal over here. You're in that stupid. You have crab bumps? Yeah. Say it now, Craig. Three, six, nine. All lands. Damn, she died. <laughs> That's funny. I was like, I have no idea what you're talking about. All right. I would like to. All right, all right, all right. Let's see here. Yeah, I know you're gonna block one. You have to. That's a lot of tap. You sure do have to. It's oh, no. almost all tap. Sure. Yeah. Um, I mean, yeah, I don't know if I want to shot. One, three, three, and I'm gonna draw. Let's see. So what can I cast? Mimic copies in a track, so which isn't great. Skyclave mimic isn't bad. But I can't take both. Yeah, I think I take steam vents. Leyline binding. So I got land enchantment. I need a creature. Do I take Marina? I, can... I don't have black. So I guess it's Elish Norn. Right. Enchantment. Land creature. Cool. Cuts. Alright. Let's go to my hand. Move to discard. <laughs> Uh, I've got nine, so that's a pretty big like, grip over there. I'm gonna go with a beanstalk and an omen of the sea. Oh, okay. And then pass. Did you play a land for turn? I'm on my end step, so. I did not, but I'm on my end step. Was this just better? <laughs> I didn't even realize this was in my hand. Maybe it wasn't, I don't know. Did you land right where you needed that? Reflector Mage? Bounce yeah, tracks it. It's game. That's, that was the thing. I go through all these motions, and you could have just shown it from your hand. I want to see what you're going to get. True. We still have potentially two more games. Uh, the way you draw with that deck, and the way that I draw in any deck, I think you got it. You always have the Storm Seeker. You always do. And you always have the Vanguards. Yeah. So you always have the maximum damage potential. Well, it's like. Everything in the list, with the exception of the one drops, I think, is a four of. So, yeah. You know, realistically, there aren't that many creatures in the deck. There's just multiple copies of everything. We run pretty lean. And mean. Well, no, but even f four. Like having four of something, you should have it in 15 cards, right, on average. Yeah. But you don't see 15 cards per turn, no, or per game, unless you're a collected company. No. Um, but you always have the Stormseeker. Well, if you don't have it, you mulligan. <laughs> sure. You know, it's there is a very <clears throat> specific sequence that is going to win you the game. I mean, it can be a couple variations, but, you know, that's the only reason I kept that hand and it didn't have a one drop. Yeah. Well, my point is, I will have four of a card and never see it in three rounds. You have the unluckiest draws. They yeah. are epically bad. Yeah, it's true. Um, you should get a different hobby, honestly. <laughs> I don't know why I keep playing this game sometimes. We could I ask myself a... that at least once a week. We could open a Yu-Gi-Oh! show. We should all play Digimon. I hear that's a good game. No. Is it a good game? It's incredibly cheap. Because none of it has value. <laughs> it's just like, it's a weird... I watched a demo of a playthrough match, and it it's a weird math game. Yeah. I watched some people play One Piece, and that actually seems like a pretty good card. I haven't yeah. seen anybody play that. So my distributor picked up Lorcana, and I was like, oh, sweet. I'll take, like, three cases of boosters and, like, some of the troves and whatever. And they're, like, they're really favoring stores that sign up for... I think they call them battle stores or whatever. Mm. And the allocations came through, and they're like, each store that isn't signed up to run events gets two boxes. Oh. And I'm like, maybe someone should explain to Ravensburger that if you gave us enough product to see if we like playing the game, we might we actually, might actually play the game. Yeah. I played Lorcan, and that was pretty fun. 
I don't need another ridiculously expensive card yeah, game. To it's play. also ridiculous. If we're gonna pick up another game, the I'd latest set doesn't look like it's, it's very really cheap. holding much value. I think they're starting to print too much of it, and that's definitely true for One Piece. Yeah, the newest set is like barely above cost, and if you're selling it online, you're losing money. I will play first. That seems legit. Yeah, he just cast Mind Slaver and used it on you, so. Can I? Good, good. I need lands to do something. I'll try it. Me too. So, yeah, I was expecting to just do a half a barrel and swing in. But I do have a, another. Oh, actually, you could have still lived in half a castle this time. Uh, but I had to do the same this way anyway, so I'm not sure. Um, do I trade creature value against your Oh, the card is not great. This card card to draw from. Right, they have a lot of damage. So I don't know if it would have been enough, but I should have grabbed the Titan of Industry. Okay. Made a Rhino and gained five life. Uh, that would have been a better plan. Right, on the draw, we'll keep that. Let's turn. That would be the combo. Bottom. Let's do it. Headquarters. Your turn. Tap breeding pool. We'll go ahead. Uh, the beans. Mm -hmm. Draw a card. Beans. Pass. And so it's not double your draw damage. Play tap Temple Garden. Experiment one. Go ahead. Good. Some pedal grow. Overlord. Yeah. Ending cost. Trigger, because it's a five drop. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Four. Land. That's a treasure. Pass. It's a blue courtyard. Name human. Mm -hmm. That's problematic. Trigger bean stuff. Yes. Uh, pass. I'm not sure if that double triggers there. Uh, if a permanent entering the battlefield. But does she? She entered the battlefield. <laughs> if any permanent entering the battlefield causes an ability of something to trigger, right? Right. But she, does she cause her own? Does she cause herself to double? I don't, I, I don't know. I'm just gonna. Go to my end step. Well, and you just cast it for five. Yeah. Because she's on the battlefield before it would check, right? No, because I'm gonna. So, okay, over here. I'm, before I forget again, that's gonna be because on two it's a cast one. trigger. So oh, you yeah. would cast her. Yeah. The trigger triggers. Yeah, right. It resolves. Yeah, I was. Okay. Anyways. Yeah, I was like, I was like, it's in the yeah. words. I'm pretty yeah. sure. Yeah, yeah. I'm awesome. just brain dead. Yeah. No, it's Friday night. I get you. <laughs> Good. Yeah. All right. Ooh, okay, that. Like, I played her and then immediately realized I forgot the trigger at my end step, and then I was like, wait, that trigger draw. Yeah. She doesn't have a lifelink. So, we can continue doing things. Experiment one. Pack leader. No evolved triggers. 
Um, go to combat. Give it to the pack leader. Swing for eight. Four, three, two, three, three, two? Yes. No, two, two, one. So four. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. Four, three, um, two, three. Yeah. Block the pack. I'll trigger oh, your draw. I'll trigger my draw. I'll block the pack leader. And then yeah. I'm taking four, correct? Correct. Okay. So he'll die. Play a tap land for turn. Pass. Sorry, buddy. This is a new deck to me. No ETBs is very problematic. Right. City's blessing. And I don't think I can kill you before the squirrel comes in. <laughs> squirrel comes in. This dude. Oh. He's gonna get sacrificed. Oh. That's very fair. To be fair, you only Yep. Uh, she vigilant. I'll attack. Yeah, I will take the four, go to sixteen, and then I'll go to my end step, sacrifice it to this, go mm -hmm. six drop. You got it. <laughs> like, is it massacre worm? I don't think it's massacre. I did put in a mask. I'll grab this overlord. Trigger, trigger. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright. And two draws? No. It's, not, it's a cast trigger. Oh, it is a cast trigger. That's right. Alright, I'm going to cut this time. I don't think you feel the cheater. Yeah. That's it. You're doing shenanigans. I'm cutting. That's right. Make a samurai. Yeah. Pretty sure there's yeah, this is no a cast, way. So it's not gonna ever double trigger. Out of this. I'm taking. I mean, so that's four to anything, and then that's nine attacking. Game three. Okay. You got me. That no was a, ETBs. That was a much better kind trigger. Of or a much better trigger. Much better draw. Yes. But now we know that we do need stuff. We don't have a lot, but we do have some. Yeah, I'm kind of like winging it with my list because I only found two lists that weren't 80 card Yul Ryan lists. Yeah. And I don't, I refuse to play those. No, I don't want to play them in paper. Um, Online's then, okay. So it's like, and then I didn't have all the cards because I'm still waiting for stuff. Mm -hmm. So then I made some substitutions, but then my mana base is different. Yep. So it's just kind of feels like, clunky. Yeah. yeah. I only have like three lands that produce black, and it's like, I don't really need it. And then it's like, wait, no, I do. Until you do. Right. Yeah. No, because I drew the Atraxa or something. But the overlords being okay. enchantments that you can cheat into play is and then sacrifice to the incarnation. And then the, the green one makes the fourth land for you, so if you miss your land drop, like I always do, you can still cast the incarnation on four. Very solid. So I like it. Well, and once you have all the pieces, it'll yeah. a little I'm missing smoother. one of the green overlords and one red overlord. Oh, yeah. And then I was just playing around with different numbers of each thing. I really like the Roaring Furnace. Um, but most lists aren't running it. Yeah. But it's kind of cool because depending on which door is unlocked, it gets you a different mm -hmm. CMC. It's a good archetype. Um, I feel like it has a lot of avenues. Yeah, and it, you can kind of tweak as you want. It makes me feel like I'm playing Birthing Pot again. Right on. Makes sense. I will take the play. You said draw. I heard I it. I didn't say it. I thought started to. Um, I'll keep this, I guess. I don't think I can keep that. Five lands, one beanstalk, and a five drop. Ah, you'll get there. I'll be at two life when I do. But well, you'll get there. <laughs> and I was missing blue mana, too. Oh, yeah. Okay. I don't know that there's much blue left in the deck, but... 
Do this thing. We go territory. Name who man? Experiment. Experiment one. Go. Forest. Talia. Evolve. Swing for two. Eighteen. And go ahead. Fire you for five. All right. What's this do? Roaring That's furnace. Legal. And then it costs one extra to pass because it's a uh, 19. Okay. So it'll do five to Thalia. I can't believe I've been bane fired. Okay. Seems good. And then I will pass. Land. Well, we we are no, no. nothing makes sense to me. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Lord Rakdos. Well, that makes my decision very easy. Oh, this is a theme deck. Two yeah, yeah. vanguards. Okay. Uh, yeah. Only two creatures. my flavor. They each get one. One. I'm happy that you're doing something that makes you happy. Move to right. combat mm -hmm. and swing for seven. Uh, I mean, that's, that's uh, I'm playing Bane Slayer. That's, that's kind of annoying that I had a Bane Slayer Angel in play and you killed me with a Bane Fire. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's not flavor. Yeah. That's anti flavor. Yeah. No, that's what it was designed for. Uh, nope, no land drop. No, I slay the Banes. I no land drop. Oh. I don't know that I could have done much. If I played... That was the rest of my Coco. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so I can play this, kill Thalia, or kill the Lieutenant, mm -hmm. but that's still and lethal. Still, yeah. Didn't draw land. I, uh, it's a great 4-drop if I can cast it. So I did bottom a land. Mm -hmm. um, and I should have bottomed the Incarnation, because I don't have... I didn't have a blue source. Yeah. That was the greedy part, but not having <laughs> there's a swell from some they couldn't cast. Give me tap the peril. <laughs> like not having a land for five more turns is nuts. Mm -hmm. So yeah, she would gain four life, make some blockers. Um, yeah. And you had more land. Well, I guess if I cast it. Please don't tell me that. Yep. Why do you have that? 